Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to Dirty Rotten Scoundrels. This is a movie request from someone on Patreon. Thank you for requesting, you know who you are. I have heard of this movie, I don't know what it's about, I have no idea. I know it's old, it's 1988 I believe, and it's, yeah, I don't know if it's black and white, if it's not. I really don't know anything about it except the name. I've heard the name Dirty Rotten Scoundrels. I'm guessing like an action thing? Maybe a mafia type thing. Maybe it's come on honestly it could go either way. I don't know. So thank you for requesting. Thank you all for watching. I really hope you enjoy this. I really love the support from all you guys on Patreon so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um other than that, let's just get right into this, okay? Here we go. I'm liking the music to begin with, honestly. Nice, it's not black and white, but it is like old school, I can tell. It's like film. The men of my country are proud. They would die rather. I recognize his voice though. But for the children. Is this a scam or something? But I I'm getting like scam vibes. Fake charity, making money. Steve Martin. Oh wow. Michael Caine? That's the voice I recognized. Oh, uh, so they like con men. I like a good con story. That's why I love leverage. She's the blonde in the blue sequin dress. Extremely rich. Uh, Very mad. Mock. Imminent. And a willing infidel. Oh, uh, Michael Caine. Oh, he looks so young and... Different, the mustache. Would you see what you can get for this, please? Not the royal ring, your highness. You want the whole world? The scam, I love it. She's just listening in. No, madame. Uh, but you brought in your highness. It was a faux pas. Please forget it. Mm. You can trust me. I won't. <laughs> madame, I am the police chief of the oh. Monsignor. Well, yeah, don't. What makes you Americans think that I'm. Buy anyone at any price. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh. Oh. <laughs> We're just in the plant. Why do I recognize her? No, I'm an American, Fanny Eubanks, of Omaha. Mm, Omaha. But I cannot accept it. You've already risked too much just in speaking to me. I still want to help. Why is who? Would randomly go up to me like, I want to help you. Just because they're royalty. I have powerful enemies. They may be watching even as we... My God, you're attractive. <laughs> just have to stop to say that. I must go. Just, what? Jumping out? Into the... What? Please? You must tell me where he lives. Why do they just keep going into these plants? Fanny, the freedom fighters thank you. He's just giving, she's just giving him all her jewelry. This goes to me, which means it is time to go to Zurich. Zurich, what's in Zurich? I love that when you're up though, love a good European tale. Steve Martin! Oh my gosh, he's so young, I love him. Is he also a con man? American one. Really starving. <laughs> Racist. So is he like the less refined American con man and is like the refined one? What a <laughs> I'm saving my money for something special. My mother. Your mother? Well, he sees. She's not really my mother. My real parents didn't want me. Oh, tragic backstory. Oh, I'm sorry. 
get but some sympathy. Is a woman. She has a laugh that can make the bird sing. <laughs> okay, she's disconnecting again. Chocolate milk and two beers. Why don't you have a beer? Three beers. <laughs> oh my god. It's a small con, but it's a con. Didn't you say she was taken ill? I tell them what they want to hear if it gets me what I want. You're just admitting to lying. You could go with long with lies. I can tell you've got a lot to learn about women. Yes, I'm afraid I am. Freddie Benson. He's suited, wearing the newspaper. He's wearing a weird hat and reading mad. That probably shocks a guy like you, right? Well, it's rather uh. revolutionary. He just stole a bunch of money from a woman, so I don't think he's... That's what I did in the dining car. She gave me a hundred francs. That, that, that's like, uh, twenty bucks. Oh. Do you have any idea what it feels like to take a woman for twenty bucks? Yeah, twenty whole I'm bucks. I'm it's a little out of my class. Mm. Yes, I live there. I'm considered to be the town's playboy. <laughs> <laughs> now, all the social activity has gone to the Italian... What I feel like... Steve Martin's character just came in and he's conning him. He knows who he is. Huh. It's like a long con. Still doesn't have to check it out. Oh, both got their hand. Another huh? retired couples. Uh, how far up is Portofino? Portofino. It's about 170 kilometers. And it rains. No. <laughs> Did he call her when he left? phone call did not give me much time. Marion was perfect. Ah, so, yep, it was planned. You can't be too careful, Andre. After all, a poacher who shoots at rabbits may scare big game away. That's true. If he's walking around your town making noise, then that's messing up your game. Hey, Laurence, listen to this. A clever young American con artist Nicknamed the Jackal. The Jackal, oh. She should be arriving at approximately. Uh huh. Here she is now. The next con, okay. Well, I would very much like to help you, Grandmother. Oh, no. <laughs> and he's with her, oh my god. Yes. No, I'm, I wouldn't expect that. That's strange. There's a young man with her. Mm. He's the Jackal. No. What is he gonna try to scare him off? Bonjour. Bonjour. She's just taking her car. <laughs> He's <laughs> Steve Martin. I love him. I a lot of bags. Oh my god. Wow, he is pale. Have you seen enough, Mrs. Oh, it's her. That money was supposed to go toward an operation for Oh. He got him to go to her and oh, okay. Yeah, comment. Ooh, he's just destroyed his con. Woman, come on, you're French, you understand? Oh, that? okay. You as a woman, that is French. To be called, that is American. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Lawrence Penn. Low. Wow. Lars. Lars. He is Lawrence. struggling. This is me trying to remember names in these movies. <laughs> Jemison. Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes! We're like this! Mm. Really? This is really very serious. We don't treat gigolos like robots. Gigolos? Five years ago, they still cast me. Oh, God. <laughs> He's so messy with them, I love it. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, 
Say that's a no. Lawrence Jameson. Getting him out of his country. We'll like you out. <laughs> oh. She's, oh no. He, and then he's gonna talk to her. He's gonna learn that he's a con man. <laughs> come, come up. Just don't make her hood or neck hair. <laughs> Dude, follow. The prince. The prince? Mm-hmm. Shake your hand and pat you on the back. Yeah. Fanny, you back? Of Omaha? Oh, she, of Omaha. He knows all the rich people in Europe, but not here. You're financing my mission? Perhaps his highness. He's a freedom fighter. And it's clicking. You just got played yourself, dude. You have done a wonderful thing. Nah. Oh, he's gonna come back for payback. Said you would recognize the secret password. Mm -hmm. What secret password? Lady Fanny of Omaha. <laughs> Go ahead, Arthur. Wow! <laughs> that was quite the view. All I can say is wow! What an asshole I was telling you how to take women. All right. <laughs> Money from a man who needs every penny to free his enslaved people. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? This! This! I want! He wants to be just like you. I got time. Why should I help you? Guy with my mouth could ruin a lot of business around here for you. Ooh. Threatening. All right. I'll do it. I'll teach you, I'll set you up, and I'll pay you a percentage. Right. Okay. But with this Team. Month, understand. I run this operation, and you do as I say. Great! Until one day he's going to want to do it all. There is a man who owes me a favor. Rene Zenai. He is a master with his stiletto and an absolute magician at hiding a body. <laughs> as police, I tell you, it is a mistake to take him in. I am taking him in gracefully. In order to get him out. Okay. How's he gonna do that? What the fuck? Was a slime? Oh my god, how much do you need of that shit? It's all pink too. Trying to make him into a gentleman. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Judges watching. Oh, okay. Be careful. <laughs> what was this performance? Was how you pour yourself a drink? Well done. <laughs> I look great, don't I? I know the moves. Yes, Freddy, you're ready. I need to talk. Didn't I tell you about him? Ruprecht is my brother. Oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's quite the entrance there. What's he doing out here? His quarters are here. He's in, like, what, the dungeon? With bog oak? <laughs> So you're gonna be playing the crazy brother? Ruprecht, 
Actually, desire your brother. Yeah, what? <laughs> what? I'd be fucking scared. <laughs> With the tail. <laughs> Who is it? <laughs> He's so good at that. She's gonna run now. He's very affectionate. Now come along. Now. He's walking. Yes, nice lady. Mother? No, oh my god. Oh dear. <laughs> Oh, he pissed. <laughs> what? Ruprecht. What the? What? Ruprecht, no. After that. Oh. Ew. I'd be terrified too, to be honest. Oh, good. Oh, oh, good. <laughs> you want the genital cup? Oh, oh. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. He'll enjoy Oklahoma wide open spaces. He loves to run and run and run. Uh, okay. Another woman doing it again. I take your trifle, sir. Yes. Now, Diana, as you were saying, you don't think the poor should be allowed. I feel like he's going to eventually hate being, playing this part over and over. Don't take the cork off the fork. Why is the cork on the fork? To prevent him hurting himself uh, and others. <laughs> you may eat your applesauce. Oh, God. Oh, God. You pregnant? We have wonderful news. Married. <laughs> uh, maybe not. <laughs> married. And we are all going to live in Palm Beach. Palm Beach? Ruprecht! May I go to the bathroom first? Of course you may. Oh. Right there. Ew. Thank you. Yeah, run away. Driving relaxes. <laughs> Ten for you, Andre. Nice work. And the rest is for me. But what else? Wait, what about him though? Where's his money? What? What about me? What do I get? You are the student, Freddy. You get knowledge. I did most of the work. I should get my share of the you cash. You should get a share. Yeah, it's only fair. It's a responsibility, Freddy. He's treating him like a child. How am I supposed to spend my money? Now, if all these... Yeah, you shouldn't be able to control how he spends his money. If you want to send your money, you have what you want to do it. You can't fall from it. So you got a lot of wine. Yeah, I don't even like wine. It pays for its preservation. What's the angle? There is no angle, Frank. <laughs> yeah. Americans aren't as big into that. Looking at it feeds my soul. May I say something here? Oh, no. Of Are you kidding me or what? I'm with him. I'm like, if I'm making all this money, I'm not spending on sculptures to donate in gardens. In a garden that, frankly to me, looks like a big mowing headache. Now, it's true. That is a sculpture of a naked woman, and I can appreciate it. <laughs> okay, good. Otherwise, you have... And I didn't agree to playing Ruprecht the monkey boy all the time. Going it alone. Oh. Oh. Freddy. Was that his plan? Make him play the monk, the little brother, get him pissed off, and then he'll eventually just leave on his own. Don't look. I don't need these clothes. I don't need your instructions. You taught me what you know. Great. Thanks. Thanks a Yahoo. I'm getting out of this town. Ah, uh, just like you wanted. 
Then it is business as usual, huh? <laughs> Au revoir, Laurence. Au revoir, André. Uh, he's not gone quite yet. I'm trying to find out the latest stock prices to see how my takeover bid is going. You know, it's so hard to get the stock prices around here. Back to his old ways. So, what am I leaving this place for? I love me here. So, I'll be around a little bit more. Lucky mm -hmm. you. Freddy. Competition now. Sure you are, and you should be. I'm younger than you. I'm better Ooh. looking than you. I'm thinner than you. Damn. I could kick your ass off this hill in a New York minute. Uh -huh. And I could always call Lady Fanny of Omaha. Oh. The threats. I finally came to the frustrating conclusion that I had taste and style, but not talent. I knew my limitations. It's always good to know your limitations. What I'm saying is, know your limitations. <laughs> you are immoral. Oh, damn. You can try this. Suppose we try this. We find a woman, set a price, oh. and the first man to expect the correct amount from her. Okay. For love of good bet. That's a whoa. Okay, what's happening? Uh, <laughs> She's also a little bit of a mess. Easy for you. Fifty thousand dollars. Fifty thousand dollars. Out of your league. <laughs> Touche. All right. May the best man win. Thank you. What if, like, maybe one of them got her? She's like hired or a friend to come. How about? I don't know. Or maybe it, ooh, what if she's a con woman? Ready? He has dropped it from aside. Perhaps the jackal finally realizes he's no match for the lion. No, he's not gonna just run away like that. He's supposed to lose. He's trying to lose. He's trying to lose it all fast. They're gonna win again, aren't they? <laughs> it's pure luck. Well, oh, bad luck for him. Uh oh, he's here. Excuse me. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh my God. Oh my God. Pardon me. Hi. Thank you. Can't be mean to someone in a wheelchair. <laughs> How did you not notice him come in with a wheelchair? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's so extra. I love him. Excuse me. The <laughs> At least you, you did get a lot of money, at least. Something. Listen, maybe I can help you. These plants again. Your last chance for what? My last chance for an operation. Oh. Would the Navy pay for your operation? Oh, it's not for me. It's for my grandmother. Oh my god, the grandmother bit again. Those are some giant ass bills, though. Money is not that big. Ten thousand francs. Only ten thousand, though. He needs fifty thousand. So I went back to the studio. And there they were. Oh. Naked. Damn. So you got leave because of that? Because your girlfriend cheated on you? In the morning, 
I woke up and my legs were useless. No. Oh, so he's oh paralyzed mentally? Oh my god. What do you mean by astronomical? $50,000. Who? That is quite the fee for a psychiatrist. Oh god. The dance. Freddie, are you okay? Oh god. <laughs> They're dancing. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Can I go right to Dr. Schofield? Oh god, my dad. Take me from this place. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh, and is he gonna come in as Dr. Schofield? Now I'm going downstairs to mail this letter, and I'll be right back. Damn it. Still don't have the money just yet. <laughs> Be careful if she walks back in. She just happens to be in the same hotel. The guy that you were sitting next to. Hello again. <laughs> Are you Dr. Schaffhausen? Mm. Oh. I can't. Hard. <laughs> Could I just talk to Technically, you if he gives, now? she gives the money to him, the doctor, he wins. I've... You haven't given him any money, have you? Just a little bit for his grandmother's operation. Don't give him any money. Uh oh. Uh oh. You see? All right, I'll see him. That's wonderful. But remember what I said. Don't give no him any money. money. Damn. What if he's not the jackal, but she's the jackal? Boy, oh boy, you can really get lost. Maybe in I don't know. Big places. <laughs> I give up. Who? Doctor Emil Schaufhausen. Yeah. <laughs> 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 At last we meet, Officer Benson. After all those letters, I feel that I know you. <laughs> <laughs> and the game is on. Great. <laughs> so, you are numb from the waist down. Oh, God. You gotta fuck with him. Tell me if you feel this. Tee-doo, <laughs> 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 Oh, oh. <laughs> He's over some weird tests. How about what? <laughs> oh God. Oh. He's holding that in. I am renting a villa in this area. We will move him in, and I will really go to work on him. No, oh, God. Thank you, Doctor. I'm screaming. Oh, my name is Doctor Emil Schaffhausen. What? But Doctor, he's so happy. He's crying. <laughs> Because <laughs> anything, you chose to be the guy in the wheelchair. So you gotta deal with. Who's this? Oh, someone. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> How is he going to play this off to her? Oh, as a patient? 
Thank you, Your Highness. I will telephone you. Oh, please. This is the power. One of my former patients. Unfortunately, incurable. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty easy to play off. <laughs> Woman, get a hold of yourself. She will be staying at the hotel. And Professor Benson here will be staying with us. Please don't worry. You are close to my room. Mm -hmm. I shall keep my eyes on you night and day. Oh, oh God. You, Sabrina, it has a fascinating history. <laughs> Welcome to hell. Oh, <laughs> this will be fun. Oh, I understand. Let me show you the rest of Sabrina. Okay. Oh, whoa, moving fast. Mm, can't go up there. <laughs> Come on, Freddy, you gotta be Come back. Try again. Oh my god, Freddy. Oh, and I pulled myself up the stairs, and then I saw you and him. Oh my god. He sees us dance, the more he will get used to it. Oh. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Find this. To be successful. Of course. You will sit here. Thank you. I will sit here. And Freddy. We'll sit there. Uh -huh. Little kid's table. I've lost hope. Would you please see that my grandmother gets my insurance and if my body's washed ashore, that my remains are clean. Oh my god. Any river, he's gonna drown himself. Oh my god. There he is, doctor. Louder. <laughs> Oh God, what are you, are you really gonna go down there? Oh my God. <laughs> oh, don't do it, oh God. <laughs> He's ridiculous. Not looking, I will come down here and I will do it right. And I'm not going to leave you. Oh, God. I'm going to get Dr. Schaufhausen. Oh, uh, well. All right, so either she's fully just a really gullible person who's a very nice person, too, or she's the jackal and she's really a con woman. One of the I'm two. Sorry. I'm just very distracted by the water behind and the where they are, the beach. It's so beautiful. Miss Colgate. Oh. Oh. Almost. May I talk to you? <laughs> okay. You just want to sit there and miss all the fun. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> this seems crazy for other people, probably. Yeah, the people behind look <laughs> a little pissed. Who's the asshole? Get up and dance, he says. I like to smack him one. <laughs> yeah, his mistake was bringing them to a public place, because this looks insane and cruel. He's gonna do something, yep. He's got a plan. Give you a little kiss. Well, if you think that it would help. Yes, I think it would help. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why? Why is she believing this? 
There's a transport plane leaving for Honduras at one o'clock tonight. How'd you like your friend to be on it? Oh. <clears throat> San Andrew Honduras, damn. You had to raise the money? Well, the cash prize wasn't quite enough, so I had my father sell off the car. And... Cash prize? What cash prize? From the contest. You know, I was selected as the United States Soap Queen. Oh. That's why I'm on this all expense paid trip to Europe. So she's not actually rich. I just used their laundry detergent. You see, I entered the contest and then I won. Hmm. Now I'm feeling like that she is a calm woman. But you'd sell everything that bought the money? Well, it's not everything. I'm keeping the main thing. Is that wrong? The fact that she hasn't paid the money yet, and that she's suddenly not a soap heiress, and she has this sympathetic the backstory. Just people like your sister. He's actually falling for her. Agenda. Both of them are. Yeah, I think she is the con woman. She's getting sympathy, love, making them like her. Only by selling everything she owns. Oh, come on. She's keeping the mink. I mean, if we take it for everything, she still comes out of it with a very, very nice mink. <laughs> Freddy. Freddy, come on. We'll make her the bed. You're going to win her? Oh, God. What do you think I am? First one to get her into bed. Oh, ew. That's Don't gross. Don't you ever have an emotion that originates above the waist? <laughs> no! <laughs> At least he knows it. And he's about to have some alone time with her now. Captain? Which one of you is Oh, 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 damn. You be all right? Oh, yeah. She said she'd meet me here. Wish me luck. <laughs> I think you're the only person in the world who could give me that desire. Oh my god. What do you mean? Come on. You know what he means. Here. What are you doing? Now, stand up and walk to me. Oh, it's like a little child. Come on. Let go. This is so ridiculous. I'm standing. I'm standing. <laughs> yes, now walk. You won't let me down. No, I won't let you down. That's it. Bring <laughs> the music. Oh my God. You're doing it. <laughs> He's so extreme. <laughs> Oh, I want to see just how far I can. Walk to me. I, I'm still afraid. Now, don't be afraid. <laughs> don't you want to kiss me? Oh, God. Yeah! If you come over here, I will prove that I love you. Oh, my God. You can do it. Come on. Take a step. Oh, nice to have you. <laughs> <laughs> He's already undressing. Oh. Oh, he's just standing there the whole time. Oh. This is part of the plan. It's moments like this to make being a doctor worthwhile. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh no wonder they call you a genius. You said that he would come here tonight and he did. You said that he would walk and he did. Oh my god. I'm beginning to believe this man can really perform miracles. <laughs> Ooh. He played you there. Beginning to believe it too. <laughs> yeah. He uh, thought you there. I never got on it. There were six sailors in the back of that truck. Seven sailors, Freddy. I am a Royal Navy volunteer reserve. Oh. Uh -huh. Well, then how do you plan on doing that? How do you plan on getting her to the airport without Mr. Freddy Benson on you like glue? What are you doing? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, now you're in trouble. Hey, would you take care of my friend? 
wait till I get back. <laughs> Damn. He will follow you. But how do I know that Trust he... me, just one last time. All right. He's actually trying to protect her, which is kind of nice. You do what I tell you, and you can keep the faith. You're kidding. Yes. Oh. You're wonderful. She did never pay the money, we never saw the money, and but she's gotten plane flights, she's gotten all these nice amenities. <laughs> Is Freddie on the plane? Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> He knows how to charm. Had a great time. Could you hand me that super glue solvent? Oh, they glued him. <laughs> See that plane? There goes your bed. Janet's on it. Did she get on it, though? She's gone. Have a safe trip and a prosperous career. I'll be to the end. It's not <laughs> over yet. Something else is gonna happen. I feel like he's gonna discover something in here that proves that she's not Janet. Oh, no, she's back. Whoa. It sucks because she really, like, fell in love with Janet. She fell in love with Freddy, but um, what's his name actually fell in love with her. And he's not, Freddy's not in love with Janet. Yeah, you made this one fall with you and you don't feel the same way. You gotta feel a little shitty about that. I feel like he's not gonna do it. Me either. Could you close the drapes? Sure. I really thought she was gonna be like the calm woman here that's actually tricking them, but I don't know now. <laughs> he didn't realize he's already lost. He has to leave. It's on me, sir. With the curtains drawn. Oh. And for how long? Oh, not long, but long enough. Yeah, you lost. It seems the teacher has underestimated the student. Yeah. At least he's not taking like a soul loser. Doesn't sound like a guy walking. Ah, it's her. Janet. What? Did he leave her in bed? And then what happened was, I fell asleep, and when I woke up, he was gone. Oh. He took all my money. He didn't he though. She's trying to get money from him. She's trying to con him. Oh, and she's about to get 50000 from him. Oh, she is good. Right now, he's probably, Freddie's probably asleep in bed, and she's locked him in there or something. Dude, you can't play. You can, and you will. Take it. He does actually care about her. It sucks for him. Jenna, come on. You'll change planes in Paris. Okay. She's gonna get off in Paris and stay in Paris. If you're ever in Cleveland, will you call me? I bet. Dude, come on. See this. It doesn't belong to me. And I'll always have something from you that means much more. She already Bye. took it, didn't she? It's in her little bag there. I don't... Bye. The random going back to give it to him. What a, what's in the bag? You gotta stop her. Hey. 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 Hold me. Hold me. Hold me. Hey. Yeah, she played you both. She's going 
gone, my clothes are gone, my wallet's gone, my watch is gone. She even took the 2,000 francs she gave me. You really expect me to believe that when she's just returned the $50,000? Have that you I looked in the bag? The $50,000 you stole from her. I didn't steal $50,000 from her. <laughs> hey, there's my clothes. Yep. You got played. Hello, boys. It was fun. I'll miss you. Love, Janet. The Jackal. Jackal. P.S. I'm keeping the money. Is that wrong? Mm hmm She's good. She's real good. Oh, oh, the louse! She is disgusting! She is lying! She is deceitful! She is two-faced! She's good. And she is dishonest! <laughs> he loves it. Yeah. He met his match. Isn't she wonderful? <laughs> he loves her. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. It was the fall in the beginning. Like, the fall suddenly making noise to make herself, herself seen. Telling people that she's like a soap thing just to be like, get the word around. Sorry, I broke your VHS player. Uh -huh. I want you to give me the make and model number. As soon as I get settled, I'm going to send you a check. Oh, no, geez. he's not. <laughs> you know, I kind of had it figured from the beginning. Jay, oh, Janet, did Jay, you? Jackal. No. When you think about it, it's obvious. <laughs> when do you think she was on to it? From the beginning. Yeah. All, the whole time. She was on to us. Goodbye, Freddie. What? Tourists? Why are they? Who are these people? Is it Janet? Hey, hello. We made it. Could you get the bags up here, Pronto? Yeah, thank you. What is she doing? The wig. Now, first, intros. Nikos, Nikos, get over here. <laughs> You got another con. I want you to meet Mr. Big Stuff. <laughs> I was showing Nico's property in Florida. He goes, if I'm going to invest 16 million bucks, I want to do it someplace new. I ah, think the three of them work as a team. Ship's so tall. <laughs> She's good. Go with it. You want you going to say anything? Good eye, Nikos. How's it going, <laughs> The whiz kid, Randy Bentwick. Unfortunately, Randy is a mute. Oh, always the butt of the jokes. That's it, keep going. I'll be right up there. <laughs> Fellas, last year I made three million dollars. Three million, damn. Your 50,000 was the most fun. <laughs> She had fun with them. She wants it more. Are you ready? Then let's go get them. Oh. <laughs> I love it. We have the three. <laughs> love it. <laughs> Freddie, Lawrence, and Janet working together in the end. I love that. But this was great. I love a good con thing. That's why um one of my favorite shows is Leverage. Loved that show and the con. It's, I think because I've watched that show and I've watched a lot of con stuff and I love that kind of thing, that's probably why I could tell that Janet was a con woman. It took me a little while to realize it was she was the jackal. I forgot about the jackal for a moment because they kept saying Freddy was the jackal. But then I realized, wait, Freddy's never said he was the jackal. And Janet's the sec like I from the second Janet came in the picture, I was like, okay, maybe. And that would also be a fun twist. That'd be cool. But then once um, she started talking about how she's not really a soap heiress and her sob story and stuff, I was like, ah, mm, the con. And she got both these men. She was just watching them make fools of each other and so busy with each other that she was able to skate right by without them noticing anything. I loved that. And all of them were great. Lawrence, Freddie, Janet. The acting was brilliant. The music, the locations were cool. Um, it was hilarious. It was it was much funnier movie than I thought it would be. It was so funny, especially Freddie. Steve Martin, 
comedy genius. Love him. I need to see him in more stuff. I'll always love him ever since Cheaper by the Dozen as a kid. I don't know what else I've seen him in. I can only think of Cheaper by the Dozen and um, Only Murders in the Building. I can't think of anything else I've seen him in. But now I've seen him in this. Well, that was Dirty Rotten Scoundrels. Again, thank you for the person on Patreon who requested that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You know who you are. Uh, I also want to just thank everyone on Patreon in general because you guys are such ride or die people. I love you guys. You guys are so supportive. And also everyone on YouTube, also so supportive. If you're watching this on YouTube, wherever you're watching this, I just want to thank you, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you have enjoyed my reaction and are having a fantastic day. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.